Okay, today we're going to make a mining rig. No one's made one like this before, and I don't think no one's want to make one like this before. Okay, first thing you need are your GPUs, because I'm trying to find these and like, this is a mining GPU, so it's not a GPU, but, but anything, you're going to need some parts. This, the way I'm going to do it, that's going to save you some money. If you have a gaming PC, this is a uh, 3080, and it's a 3600X, so it's like a crazy picture now. But anyway, so you need some video cards. You're going to need, uh, this is an old 478 gig. Can't find them. Go to the new stuff, the 30 series. You're gonna need a mining frame, so that's probably where I'll start off. It was this. Oh, sorry, don't need to connect to this. So you need that. Then the second thing you're gonna need is it's a mining power supply. Don't suggest this one because it is kind of a, a pain to set up. As I'll show you right off the bat why. Actually. Had, this is what it looks like. This is why it's a pain. See these copper, and they are copper. They are these are they're like grounding rods. They have ring terminals, so you have to chop them off, and then so you have to electrical tape. So these wires, one, the black one's negative, and this is positive. So pretty simple. Oh, and then you have. Six pins, and there's a bunch of them. Plus, it comes with adapters. The reason I got this is because don't need this because it was like twenty-seven bucks, and then it came with all these. A six pin and then it's split and it goes to uh, six plus two and there's like two of them. So you got these. And then you're gonna need the, the biggest part of them all at once is this thing. It's a PCI X1 to four. These are about 20 bucks except for this little thing. This is for Windows. Okay, and then the, another important part are you're going to need these. They're going to, they're, uh, I don't know how to say it, but they're risers. But what you need to get, make sure that they have PCI 6 pin because if you don't get six pin, if you get the ones with just Molex or SATA, you're gonna, this is not gonna work. So you need these. Okay. It's like, oh, this is just like, no, the, oh, and then you're gonna have to use the, uh, like this is a, okay, you're gonna need this little USB cable. It's like, oh, this is like going like every other video. No, the twist is coming. And then I would suggest one of these. You need a kilowatt meter because I'll explain that later in the video. And then here's a twist that nobody seems to want to show. Okay, you're going to what the heck are these? All right, see, they're USB extension cables. They are, there we go. You're going to what the heck do you need these for? They are 10 feet long. They are 
being that or they're attacking well, they're male on one side and these are female on this side. You definitely need this because I know you trolls are thinking, well plug this in plug this into here and then plug this into here. But there's one problem. You see there's only, like when you have your video card, you only have about a foot. By the time you put this in here, you're going to have the mining rig sitting next to your PC. Here comes the twist. So you get this, then you get these cables, and you plug these extension cables. And I think they're like 10 foot, I think they're like 8 bucks or 2. Oh, 40 bucks. Because you're trying to find a Azrock VT motherboard, good luck with that. They're about $89 if you find them on Newick. So what you, you ended up with something like this. And then you're going to have to get some electrical tape. Let's go find some electrical tape real quick. Kind of. And why you want to do, why I say this is best because let's say if you're Living at where the rent or the electricity is free. What we're doing is we're making a standalone mine rig, or it's not a standalone. It's a pretty much you plug it into a PC. And so what you're doing is your landlord knocks on the door, it's all going to be on this. You can easily. Turn the computer, like, un do the computer, unplug this, wrap this around this, and put some laundry over this. And then he was like, what's eating, what's, what's taking up 800 watts? But what we can also do is turn the heater off your house because this is about to be your heater. Because and it doesn't have to be. I kind of want it to look okay looking. I don't want it looking like garbage. Sorry, dude. You see cables ran everywhere. It's kind of how what this is. It's got three, it's got four, like four, yeah, four, four K monitors. So there's wires going everywhere. Because I know everybody, or well, almost everybody, has a gaming computer. Doesn't you don't have to have a 380 in the gaming computer? But most PCs, you're gonna have to some have to have some kind of graphics card because some computers won't the PCI X1 slot. I don't want to get short by four inches, but you should be you should end up with something like. This and this. That's what you see ended up with. One big long cable. So you can move this mining rig 10 feet away from your computer. That's what this is for. Give or take. Big like that. So that's that's pretty much it. Is the power supply. You can use computer power supplies. You're just going to have to jump them over. You're going to have to, uh, they make little. You can use two, so you're gonna, you're just gonna have to bear with me. So, and then what you do? Oh, and then another thing, the the ones for parallel miner, the ones oh, this one, oh shoot, that's what I was doing. They had the the ones with the breakout boards and the little buttons. Those are better because they're not they're not as confusing. Uh, yeah, this will hold four video cards. One, one, two, three, four. Because I cut it short like that. So I only need uh, three more of these. And this is back. These are spares. So what you 
Find 380 is trying to find a unicorn. Everybody's trying to Bitcoin mine. Yeah, because what I don't like about it is this is see these cables, they go one goes over here, one goes over here, so they're kind of like like the other one, it's two, one wire goes to one plug. Make sure you plug these six pin power into the uh, risers. You know, I've seen people that forget this. They're going, what the heck is it not working for? Just push that in that. And one, I mean, you can, depends where, how, man, like what, how many powers, like this takes an eight pin and this is a six pin. You can, you can wire it. The risers use about 30 watts. That's why you don't want to power them by Taylor because you'll burn them up. And this just goes up top. And then you can power just the risers and then you can use, use another cable for the uh, Because like, all it is is all these things are, are USB cables. He converts uh, into USB. Now, I don't know how far these would go, so that is a question. But I wouldn't go any further than 10 feet. I know they make active cables, but good lord, they, when you get past 10 feet, they get expensive. Like, it's like $30 for one cable. That'd be expensive. Could you, like, go? One cable into many, and don't know that. So, yeah, so. not suggest you pull a lot of wires from extension cords. This is to show you. This is example. Because you're going to see what this thing is trying to do. So you plug this into extension cable. Or you plug the extension cable into this. And then Where? 
with me. I'm looking. Don't help us. Alright. So what you have to do is now you plug it in. Now the bad thing about these various power supplies, they whine. Okay. You headphone users, you might want to take them out and listen to them loud. It's gonna ramp up and it's gonna settle back down. Here that that does not sound like that all the time. Watch, it'll wrap, it'll go back down. Watts. That's what, if you can hear that, that's what sound it makes. Like, it's not too bad. Alright. So, let's unplug this one for now. So, and then what you got to do is turn off the PC. Yeah, when you have three 4K monitors, that's and then you're trying to uh, look for a little tiny mouse cursor. It makes it a pain. You got to play, you got to figure out what screen it's on. Okay. Let's see. Turn that down. Or you could just turn the off switch in the back. There you go. And then you're Bill Cool. Then you just. Okay, I have a extension. Yeah, sorry, this camera does not have a focus. It's fixed focus. Oh, wait. Chat ID. Tripod does this. Let's go for a ride. Okay. What we got is see that. That. No, you cannot see it. Okay, you can kind of see it. It's this is a extender. That's for another video. That's another. And if you had this bracket on, you could put it in here and bolt it, but I took it off. Oh, yeah. It didn't like. <laughs> oh, well. It didn't. For some reason, it did not like that. I turned it off, but it still turned on when I put that in there. Yours is probably not going to do that. Okay, so you just. You might. It, yours is not going to sag like this. It looks like threading because it's been silent. Hanging in front of the TV. But yours won't do that because you has yours somewhere else. Okay. Yeah. And then I put mine here. Okay, so this, the, the 380, for some reason, they will not, or sometimes it does not, like, want to start up. So what you have to do, no, start up with three displays plugged in. So you have to unplug one, and you start it up with this thing. Oh, shoot, I screwed up. Oh, forgot to do something. That's what's kind of sucks when you do this. When you, before you uh, uh, turn your PC on, you must plug the miner in. Oops, my bad. Even when I mess up, and then it'll wait till it settles down. It settles down. Okay, 
So it's running. You're not hunting the video card. It's not doing anything. So you just kind of like run like that. And you start. Now you start it. Yeah. Because Azeroth mining motherboard is expensive. It's like $200. People are asking for it. Good Lord. So you just have to, I have, I have to wait until I see the bio screen on one of these. Okay, come on, which one? And it's usually that one. It's starting, and then I have to plug the cable in. And yeah, that's like that's that what happens when you buy Nathan Day. Oops, I probably haven't did it before it starts. Ah! Because this is in NVIDIA, these three screens are in NVIDIA surround. And because it's a little bit different. have to install the drivers for the video card. I got go in device settings. That's going on that thing. Or bigger. And you should have oops, click on the wrong one. Too small. Okay, well okay, let's zoom in a little bit. Or let's forgot. Can't zoom in with this camera. So you see it says, can you, okay, it says 470, and that's through the data card, over the USB cables into this. And now, this is why you want one of these kennel lines. Now it's using 28 watts, just having to spin in the fan. So, okay. Now here comes the fun part. Okay. Okay, so let's actually open, and another thing you're going to need, you're going to need MSI Afterburner. I would not, not use fucking, sorry, my bad, I would not use Watt Manor. And they said, oh, you know, they, oh, let's make a bigger search man to see what's going on. This is what mining is. It's I'm not gonna make I'm not gonna sugarcoat this stuff and then say, oh it's it's this. I'm gonna, this is behind the scene. It's just not like it's not like it bigger. Oh Okie dokie. What do we have here? Okay. Let's just mine on the 470 for right now. Because there is something I want to show you. Because people are saying, does that card uh, affect the hash rate? What I'm about to show you is, no, it doesn't. In Linux, it might, but we're not doing Linux. Why you want to do this is because you're going to want to, uh, 
glad you and I had that. Oh, wow. Hmm. going on here for some reason hmm. nice ass he doesn't see the uh, 470 that is weird but okay maybe huh But the Peter does. Oh. No? What's that? Oh, should be. Let me restart it. Usually sometimes that has a... Hmm. But yeah, this is sometimes when you take shortcuts or you try to do things, stuff like this happens. But yeah, and that's why I do not turn off the PC. It always runs all the time. If you have like four cards in there, yeah, you're gonna have to have this computer on all the time. So yeah, this is way how you because if you buy that motherboard for eighty, it, that's as cheap as you can find it, and it's back ordered. And then, yeah, see what I'm talking about? I restarted it. Let's see what it's doing. It just sits there. That's something with the 380. It's like, yeah, it, you'll sit there and sit there, and it will, just will not pose. It's like, nope. So, yeah, that's the deal. If, if you're watching this, fix that up. Might be a hardware problem. Hell, I know. It, when the first day I got this, I plugged all three screens in, wouldn't start. And, like, okay, when it's not doing anything, you unplug it, just hold the power button. It was just too slow to plug in the, the video card in to be anything. Come on. And then see if it did the same thing. Okay. Uh, Reinstall the drivers. Hmm. Might have to. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to reinstall the drivers. Uh, well, shit. When I get this figured out, I'll continue. Okay, I figured out what it was. It was Windows and had a pixel patch Windows and drivers. I didn't have to reinstall, but okay. So there's the okay. Let me see on wattage. It's using 14 watts just for the okay. This is that okay. And let's start things. Be Okay, let's not trip over anything. Let's 
start the 470 and you'll hear how it winds. This PSU. You know. Oh man. Just love having three screens. Things pop up on a different screen and you gotta drag them over. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Instantly is going up and it's just starting. Seats 62 Celsius. That's a no no. But it's doing a dollar seat. That's what's the mess. Passion. It's doing a dollar. A dollar is that. So what we need to do is. Okay. Go over to here and I increase the fan speed. So what we need to do is click on this. Power. This is a 470. So. We need to do is don't go too far down. You need to go minus ten. What you're doing is pull back the power. Don't mess with any of the other things and just click apply. Watch. That's huh. Man, fan setup. And watch the wattage. It found that the the cell sit is like lowering. See, it was at sixty. It's still mining at twenty seven and it's doing a dollar eighty five. And see it's still mining. If you lower it too much, it will crash. You do not want to lower the power rating. And it's using Oh shoot, I can twist this without making it mad. Using well, it's still using a hundred and fifty two watts or something like that. But it's I have the fans at sixty. So it's at 54. So let's click on 60. And let's go to 50. Because the target range is, is, uh, is about 60 Celsius. Okay. So it's still doing $1.85. And then it's using. Oh, it's saying a dollar. Or 150 Celsius. But yeah. So. If you have four other cards, it will still mine at the same hash rate. And so this toolbox goes in the closet and it's vented out. So I can have four other cards. So yeah, so yeah that's pretty much it. So uh, yeah, USB extension cable, it would apply. So, okay. Okay, now I kind of clean things up a little bit because you're wondering why the heck did I buy 10 foot USB cables? It's like, you're like, that's a freaking mess. This is why. Because, where's the flashlight? I don't know where I sat it. But this is why. Because, let's get a little bit closer. Okay. You don't like wires, do not watch this part. Okay, you notice you don't. You don't see that. Head up a little bit. You don't see the adapter. Why is that? Because 
when I went and got, because there, there's a slot behind this, below this 380, is going to be a, another 380. And so, there's there's going to be a mess when you, when we go to the back. i got to turn this laptop. Those cable will re we'll release. We'll, we'll get there. Bit. Need to get a moth detector out of this. Okay. Oh, technical. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to look around. Let me take you out the tripod. I don't want to take out the GoPro. This audio is garbage.
that 470 APA is adding another dollar dollar uh, 23 cents. Uh, and that's what these are setting. I undervolted it by 10. I've tried 20. Sometimes it works and sometimes it crashes. You need to increase the fan speed. So, and so, so that's $8.30. So I'm doing 98. 98 on the 380. Sometimes it will go to actually that's pretty good. Oh, this is 98. Sometimes okay. And another thing is if you move like let's okay, watch it go this way and watch. Let me. I'll open a YouTube video. I'll just play some. Let me turn down the volume so I don't get copyright. So let's and turn the volume down. So and watch. I'm getting 98 mega hash. Let me just watch something. If I go full screen, I know this and watch the mega hash usually drops. Just watch. Sometimes it'll go down to like 88. See, there it goes. It's 88. Watching a YouTube video, it goes from 98 to 88. And that's quite a mega hash. You're still making $8. Close the uh, close the YouTube video. Watch. I closed it. It goes. It's making eight dollars and eighty eight cents for the three eighty and uh, the four seventy. And watch. It, it'll go back up. It takes like sorry, dropping everything. And it slowly takes a while for it to go back. Yeah, so when it's mining, I would suggest not to watch YouTube while it's doing this. And if you can, I mean, that's why you have, like, these, these are smart TVs. And uh, see, 97. Yeah, so it, see, it popped up. That's why if you have a smart TV, that's why I use TV. So if you want to watch something, use the TV and not the computer. And so you're not affecting the mega hash. 99.071. And so it went up 99 cents. So just watching something on YouTube, you just lost a dollar a day. Is that big noticeable? No, but yeah, so that's what noise, the wine, it's not very bad. It will, okay, now it just went up to a dollar. It will increase depending on how much wattage you're pulling from it. So, yeah. That's that's it. So, gaming computer, and there's going to be, yeah. So, all right, that's it. Okay, take it easy.